So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to the link, which will be down below in the description, to download Microsoft Visual C++. And then once you're on this, you're gonna scroll down. We're gonna be having two downloads right here, x86 and x64. To know which one you need, you're gonna head over to search and type in system information. Click on it. And now once you're on this, next the system type is gonna be telling us. So for me, I'm on x64, so I'm gonna be getting the x64 download. If you want says x86 or x32, then you want to get the other download. So for me, since I'm on x64, I'm going to be getting the x64 download. I'm going to click on this, and it's now going to start downloading. And then once it's been downloaded, we're now going to right-click on it, and then click on Show in Folder. And we should now be in our Downloads folder with the download right here. And now once you're on this, you're going to double-click on the download, and then once this comes up, you're going to take this box, I agree, and then click on Install. And then once this comes up, you're going to click on Yes. It's now going to start downloading. Wait for this to load. And then once that's been done, we're now going to close out of this. And now for the next step, you're going to head over to search and type in CMD. Now, you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you're going to type in SFC space forward slash scan now and then click on enter. Then you want to run this scan. Wait for this to load. I'm going to skip the video to when the scan will be fully completed. And then once that's been done, you now want to type in DISM space forward slash online space forward slash clean up dash image space forward slash restore health click on enter you now want to run this scan as well wait for this to load and then once that's been done you just want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed